What's up guys, TC here and welcome back to Starbound. I know it has been quite some time since we've had a video. I know Starbound hasn't really been updated in a while, but I wanted to check in with you guys and uh, just kind of give you an update on my channel, uh, what I've been up to, where I'll be going, and kind of what the future of the channel is going to be. So uh, as you can see, I am at the battle facility or the battle complex, I think I'm calling it this time around. Um, things have changed a whole bunch since the last time I think you guys saw this, but it... Uh, we have tons of weapons. I think we have over 100 weapons now. I've also managed to cram all of the weapons into uh, little uh, vendors, so you can now buy the weapons. So that's a big change um, you'll find relative to the last map. Um, I didn't have, like, basically you just had like a supply of weapons and you can just pick them up. Now you can buy them in here for a price. Um, so for those people that like to kind of earn their weapons, you can get those this way. And then if you really want them without having to earn them, you can just go into admin mode and buy them that way. Um, there are an absolute metric ton of these things. It goes all the way up to here. Um, every possible weapon category you can believe. I've got um, custom armor as well. You'll see down here um, all different kinds of fun stuff. Um, the arenas are, at this point, I'm doing a lot of just bug testing. It's, it's virtually complete at this point. Um, the maps are a lot more complicated now because they have difficulty settings. So you'll see these little numbers here are uh, all things that you can kind of set the difficulty. Um, it's a lot more advanced now. The, the old battle facility is very, very basic relative to this new one. And so there's a lot more bug testing. I've been having some friends help me out on getting it bug tested. As far as the future of... Well, let's see. Let's let's step back for a second. Uh, as far as the release of this goes, um, I could probably release it like right now and it would be okay. But what I'd like to do, I'd prefer, is to hold off on the release until the, uh, the next Starbound update. And that way I can... Uh, bug check and make sure that they didn't break anything when they released their uh, their new update because what happened with every every update so far they've either added removed or changed some uh, ass some assets in the game and it's made it where it's sometimes it breaks stuff so I've had a couple weapons that were broken off of the last update and what I don't want is to put this map out and then release an update next week and you guys have a broken map so I think the best course of action at this point is to uh, kind of hang back, continue to polish the maps, continue to make more custom weapons, and uh, wait for the next release. And then I can double check, make sure it's good, and then probably within the week of the, the new update, I'll be able to push this map out for you guys to download it. Um, and like I said, there's a ton of really cool stuff. I've been advancing my, my weapons a lot. I've got weapons that transform now, like that. I've got weapons that project like platforms and stuff. Uh, it's really fun. Um, I've got weapons you can fly with. So yeah, my weapon making has gotten a lot more advanced, which kind of leads into my next part here. I, I was wondering uh, what you guys, or how you guys would feel about a weapon building series. So essentially, I've had quite a few people in the comments ask me for like a series, like a tutorial series on how to make custom weapons and guns. And for mo the most part, I have not felt confident in, uh, in, in trying to teach people. But recently, I've gotten a, a little bit more of a better grasp on how to make custom weapons, a better understanding of how everything works, and I feel like I could probably make a decent um, how-to series. And I, th I think the best way to go about it would be to start off with like a basic gun, and maybe we spend an episode, you know, building the gun so you guys understand what everything does. And then uh, we probably go into like a second episode where we maybe flesh it out in more detail. So the first episode, you'd end up with like a, a basic gun, you know, nothing too crazy. And the second episode, we flesh out the projectiles and the way it looks, maybe the way it performs. And we could have other episodes dedicated to like more in-depth things, like super in-depth looks at, um, at projectiles or animations. Uh, it, it, there's a lot of potential for it, but it's also a lot of work. So I wanted to run it by you guys and, and just kind of see... Um, if it sounds like something you'd be interested in watching, because I don't want to undertake it if it's something you guys aren't really going to care about. So if you do like it, definitely let me know in the comments below. Um, if you have any particular topics you'd like to see covered, definitely let me know those as well. Uh, I think that's going to wrap up most of what I had to say today. I wanted to kind of get that out there, let you guys know where things are. The channel is not completely dead yet. I am still alive. I've gotten a little bit more free time, so I wanted to put a video out and uh, just let you guys know I'm still around and... I am still working on this thing. It's it's a huge undertaking. Uh, there's a lot more to it than I think meets the eye. And uh, yeah, I also wanted to get that other idea out there about the uh, custom weapon tutorial. So you guys let me know. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. I look forward to hearing your feedback. I will talk to you all later.